why, why leave? Why, what was the, why would you, you know, a lot of people would have taken that offer from Paramount is what I'm trying to get at, you know, just because, oh, yes. just because of the word Paramount. Right. Um, there is a parallel universe where I stayed at Paramount or I stayed at Technicolor. And here's exactly why I left. I, this is going to sound so random and fantastical. And it, it absolutely is a, a, just a completely different chapter of my life. But I was at business school um, wrapping up the end of, um, of the degree when one of our last classes was business plan development, where we went and found a company and we built a business plan around it, like a go-to-market strategy. Yeah. And uh, a friend of mine from Technicolor actually came to me and said, hey, I am making uh, very expensive headphones out of a garage in uh, Orange County. And it's just, it's insane. We can't make them fast enough. And we think that there's a market for like super high-end headphones. And this is like right around the Beats sale time frame. Yeah. Uh, so I was like, hey, let me take your, let me take this business and run it through business plan development. And so we, we built their first business plan, their first set of financials, their first like overarching marketing plan. Uh, and it was done with a team of like five MBAs as like a part of a quasi capstone project. So I gave the business plan back. I got an A in the class. It was lovely. They walked away with their first like set of financials and modeling. And then a couple months later, like right as I was graduating, they got a phone call and he said, um, from my friend again, and he said, Hey, uh, we got a call from Atlantic records. Uh, they want us to fly to New York city and, um, basically pitch the company the company's name is Odyssey. Yeah. Uh, can you, can you go ahead and get on a plane on Friday and go do that? We, we really need you to raise some money for us. You can do that. Right. And I'm like, Oh, absolutely. I, I can do that. I hang the phone up and I'm like, what did I just sign up to do? This is crazy. Uh, <laughs> over the next five days, I worked on a pitch for Atlantic Records, asking them for four and a half million dollars to essentially start moving this company into more of a commercial project. 